Greetings, everyone. This is Live Life Well TV host, Robert Landau. We are back with another episode of our popular weekly trivia program on Live Life Well TV called True or False, but actually that's false because we have two popular weekly trivia programs here on this channel. One is called True or False, the other, I wonder if you've seen it, Take a look at it if you haven't. It is called Did You Know? But this is another episode of True or False, and it is an episode, the first of two, that is dedicated to two worlds, the worlds of geography and history. So let's get underway right after this. All right, here we go. You ready? So am I. True or false? More than one billion people live in India. True or false? More than one billion people live in India? That's true. True or false? France has a larger land area than Algeria. True or false, France has a larger land area than Algeria. Believe it or not, that is false. Next up is this. The Galapagos Islands are a part of Chile. True or false, what do you think? The Galapagos Islands are a part of Chile. Well, if you knew or guessed that that happens to be false, you are 100% correct. And here's why. The Galapagos Islands are actually a part of Ecuador. True or false, Oman is a monarchy. True or false, Oman is a monarchy. That is true. Next up is this. More people live in Africa than live in Europe. True or false? More people happen to live in Africa than they do in Europe. That happens to be true. True or false? There are no active volcanoes in Europe. What do you think about that? True or false? There are no active volcanoes in Europe? That happens to be false. And here's why. Geologists estimate that there are at least 500 active volcanoes around the world. Nearly 50 of them erupt each year. Europe has a significant number of active volcanoes that have significantly impacted the landscape of that continent. Some of the active volcanoes in Europe happen to be located in Italy, Iceland, Romania, Norway, and Portugal. Iceland, I guess, being close to Europe. <laughs> True or false, Antarctica has native tree species. What do you think about that? True or false? Antarctica has native tree species. False. Next up, true or false? Bermuda is located in the Caribbean Sea. Bermuda is located in the Caribbean Sea. What do you think? True or false about that one? Well, if you thought it was in the Caribbean Sea, it ain't. It sits all alone away from the Caribbean Sea and the Caribbean, by the way, all alone in uh, the Atlantic Ocean, kind of on par with uh, the Carolinas. If you haven't been to Bermuda, it's, an, it's a glorious place. Uh, many of you know that I was a cruise director for many years, for close to 10 years, and often visited Bermuda and never, ever got enough of it. It is pristine, incredible people, incredible topography, incredible food, incredible shopping, incredible pink sand beaches where you can just be alone on a beach, kind of like one man on an island for an entire day or two. True or false, New Zealand is the country that is geographically nearest to Australia. True or false, New Zealand is the country that is geographically nearest to Australia. 
false. Papua New Guinea, Indonesia, and East Timor are nearer. And I can attest to that because I used to often sail as a cruise director in those wonderful waters as well. True or false, Miami is on the Gulf of Mexico. True or false, Miami is on the Gulf of Mexico. You probably know the answer to that one because it is false. Miami's location is on the Atlantic Ocean, near, close to the Atlantic's confluence with the Gulf of Mexico, but really Atlantic Ocean. True or false, Maryland is located on Chesapeake Bay. True. Next is this, true or false, Norway is an oil exporting country. True or false, Norway is an oil exporting country. True, here's why. Norway is a small player in the global crude market with production covering about 2% of the global demand. Nearly all oil and gas produced on the Norwegian shelf is exported and combined oil and gas equals about half of the total value of Norwegian exports of goods. True or false, 100% of Brazil is in the Western Hemisphere. True or false, 100% of Brazil is in the Western Hemisphere. Here's the answer. True. Next up is this. True or false, Russia has never been led by a woman. What do you think? True or false? Russia has never been led by a woman. False. Four women ruled over Tsarist Russia, the most famous being you probably know, Catherine the Great. Next up is this. True or false? India was never colonized by a European power. True or false, India was never colonized by a European power. False, false. Here we have our next true or false. See how you do with this one. The Soviet Union was the first country to launch a satellite into orbit. True or false, what do you think about that one? The Soviet Union was the first country to launch a satellite into orbit. You might remember this. I, I, I don't because I was barely around, but I do remember learning about it in history. The answer to that happens to be true. Sputnik 1 was launched back in 1957 and orbited the planet for about three months. True or false, despite his reputation as a general, Napoleon actually lost more battles than he won. Is that true, do you think? Despite his incredible reputation as a general, Napoleon actually lost more battles than he won, which happens to be true. Napoleon was a brilliant commander who won uh, the vast majority of his battles, but lost more than he won. He'd like to think that he won them all, uh, but he did not. And I guess that's true of, of most generals. True or false, Julius Caesar's given name wasn't really Julius. True or false, Julius Caesar's given name wasn't really Julius. That's true. His first name was Gaius, G-A-I-U. Yes, Julius was his family name. Caesar's, uh, Caesar was an inherited nickname originally bestowed on one of his ancestors. Hmm. True or false, at one time, most of the Iberian Peninsula was ruled by Muslims. True or false, at one time, most of the Iberian Peninsula was ruled by Muslims. True or false? True. 
And with that, we have two more true or falses for you before we close. Here's the second to last one. True or false, as a young man, Adolf Hitler actually wanted to be an artist. What do you think, true or false? Actually, that's true. In his 1925 autobiography by the name of Mein Kampf, Adolf Hitler described how in his youth, he wanted to become a professional artist, but his dreams were ruined because he failed the entrance exam of the Academy of Fine Arts in Vienna. And if that wasn't enough, he was rejected twice by the Institute, once in 1907 and once again in 1908. I kind of wish he would have stayed an artist, don't you? Last one goes like this, true or false, Abraham Lincoln was the first Republican to be elected president of the United States. True or false, do you? What do you think about that? Actually, it's true. The year 1860 marks a very pivotal time for the United States, namely the election of President Abraham Lincoln. This marked election is often thought of the first event in a series that turned into the Civil War that started in April of 1861. The first president from the Republican Party, only in existence for fewer than 10 years at that time, Lincoln was responsible for many large changes and of course to this very day is an icon when it comes to American history. A perfect place to close this first of a two-part true or false series on geography and American history. Hope you had a great time. Hope you learned a thing or two. I certainly did. This has been Robert Landau, Live Life Well TV host. We'll see you for the next episode. Thanks for tuning in.